Hello friend, welcome to the channel. Today I'll show us how we can make a VPN project in SketchWin. So here yeah, I have my VPN next countries. You can add up to 100 or even a billion countries. So when it's been clicked, when my VPN is being clicked, it will change the server location. It will change the server location and try to disconnect to the new country. So from our notification, even up or outside of the app, we can disconnect, we can connect users and so on and so forth. I'll show us how we can do this with SketchWare. Show how we can do this using SketchWare. So at the end of the day, I'll be sharing the project. It will do me a big favor by subscribing. By subscribing to this video so i will share the project for us to try it for us to try it on sketchly so you can get the download link in the video description of the project so in my main now main layout added in linear one in linear one which is our main which is our main layout in which I main layout, then I added another linear container which we, we inflate our fragment activity and which inflate, inflate our fragment activity to container container which is a frame layout. So we add this button for opening our door and this test view for our app main. So when the button is clicked. When the button is clicked, it will open the app. It will open the door for where we can select more countries. So when the door, when the door is clicked, when the door is clicked, it will add, it will change, it will change the server. So when door is clicked, we are going to use it to change the server. As you can see, the door will change the server, so you can add more server, you can add more server. So in our own create, add the variables, change server, server list, server list recycler view adapter. So this server list recycler view adapter is a java file, it's a java file in our adapter, so this is it, this, this, you need to import all these files, you need to import all these files, you need to import all these files, and also this, you need to import them all, and this is our VPN files, so you can add more countries, you can add more countries by importing the file, importing the file, all you just need to do is to make get the real define. I will drop a website in our next video on where you can get unlimited websites, unlimited servers, so you can add more countries to the list. So you just need to do is import import define. So with that being said, we are going to also import all these classes. We are going to import. So as at this time, you really need to use a schedule code that supports a schedule code that supports command blocks. Cause we need to extend, we need to implement on click listener of our recycler view in Dora. So I created, added this. You need to add this code. You need to add this code. To so our more block fragment fragment transactions. So fragment transaction is equal to our fragment fragment name. So if your fragment name is not if my own fragment, you need to put your your fragment name. So it will inflate my your fragment name. Inflate your fragment name into container. So it will add your fragment name into container.
so here we are going to set our adapter our adapter so underscore dora underscore server list adapter is a recycler view in our dora so we are going to check if the, the list of countries we have is not empty in the list of countries then we are going to set adapter that's our recycler view in dora so i name mine server list recycler view so that is the name which we have set an adapter so this is where the list of our countries are so this is our server list so if you want to add more countries you just need to add servers dot add new server new server the country name the country name the country flag so the country flag you see you to get the we are going to convert the country flag to a string so we are using this code to convert the country flag to a string So if the country flag is an icon in your durable, you need to put the out the durable dot the icon name in durable. Icon name. So the next thing we're going to do. I'm going to add the VPN file name. So the VPN file name in our in our assets, in our assets, the VPN file name in our asset is Japan.ovpn. Japan.ovpn. So if your con if your file name is, for instance, sketchly.ovpn, sketchway.ovpn, we need the next thing you are going to do is put the file name. Then you are going to add the username and the password of the file so that's how to add a, a, a server you can add more unlimited servers to your server so i injected all these codes i injected all these codes to my to my views so in our dora we need to add a code to make our dora come from the right from the right hand side so I added this code to make the door come from the right hand side. The gravity should be from start. So this will make it. Then added a padding. And this is our background color. So with all this being added, it will require you. And this is our fit system windows tool. With all this being added, it will require you. Require, sorry, it will require you to add all these necessary files. So in order not to do an error, we need to add this necessary file. So this is our libraries. This is the library we use for this project. Use this library. Use this library. Then this remaining two libraries. So these are the library files we use. So this is our view for our recycler view. This is our view our recycler view this is our view for our recycler view then I injected all this so in our fragments our fragments added a linear one a linear one and converted it to a relative layout with our image view image view is the selected country from our recycler view so whenever you select any country here yeah, the recycler view the image view will update any country you select any country you select the image view will be updated in your app so this is our connect button so our connect button for starting the vpn we need to add this to our 
more block we need to add this to our more block we need to add this to our more block so anytime users denies us permission i've added a file a file picker component so if they grant us access this means the access has been granted but if it's not granted we are going to toast a message permission denied permission denied or you can toast permission denied and still request for for permission to request for permission we need to add this code to request for permission we need to add this code anytime permission is denied to request permission from users So now I'll create now I'll create or oh, add these blocks so like I say command prompt is needed command blocks is needed sorry is needed to implement change server so we need to add these codes to our to our on create here we are going to update the, the flag based on the selected icon in our recycler view and we're going to check if the user has internet connection and if if VPN has already been started. So we added these blue blocks for glide to load image from URL. So I've added this necessary import. You need to import all this. Touch not to an error. With all this being saved, we can run our VPN project. We can run our VPN project and see how it's done. So currently, my internet connection status is poor. So you can download the project and in the next video i will explain about making it available on play store because there are some lega although the app is very free you can completely use it free but you need to understand the copyleft laws so that is all if project will be on sketchly project will be on sketchly thank you for subscribing thank you for watching this video